Hey guys, so I got to get to work pretty soon here, but uh, I took the time to write some of these out. I'm going to be putting these on masks and also on t-shirts. I think I'm calling, going to call the t-shirts legal tees or admiral tees pertaining to admiralty law. Not sure about the masks. I wanted to get your opinion on which one of these you'd like to have on your mask or t-shirt and feel free to ask me questions about what these mean. For example, I'll use your breathalyzer upon seeing your medical degree. You know, that's because no one can legally give you a breathalyzer test unless they have a medical degree. This is the law, yet it happens all the time and people acquiesce because they don't know. As king, I have a few questions for you, breaking down the word asking. Do you think you have jurisdiction over a live person? Something you could ask a police officer who's really an auditor. Before I answer, can anything I say be used against me? What are they going to say? Yes. Well then, I guess I won't answer. My republic trumps your democracy. I know that's supposed to be a C. I didn't change it because I, right, I gotta go, but. Produce the injured person who has filed the verifiable claim signed in wet ink and under the penalty of perjury. Once you reserve your rights pursuant to UCC 1-308, whoever it is that's coming after you must produce that. If they don't, they have nothing. Constitutional warrior, I thought about constitutional diva for, for a, a lady. My name is private. I don't share it freely with anyone or anything in case they ask your name. And again, some of these supersede the others. You can simply say, before I answer, can anything I say be used against me? It's that simple. There's nowhere to go from there. A public servant cannot give orders to a citizen. Notice the citizen is capital C. That's a natural born citizen. Lowercase citizen is property of the government. It's a 14th Amendment citizen. Will you honor your oath of office? That's something you might want to ask them. I am making a valid reservation of rights using UCC 1-308, Uniform Commercial Code. So here are some of the things that I've written down. No man is a straw man. A straw man is a fictional person that resides in a fictional realm called the public created by the 14th Amendment. <laughs> hey guys, this is Alvin, Theodore, and Simon. Hey buddy, how are you doing dude? Hi. All right guys, I'm getting invaded by goats. All right, so yeah, um, let me know what you think. Let me know um, if you have any, if you've done any research, maybe any uh, ideas that you have to put on a hat t-shirt or a mask and uh, if you do come up with any good ones that I use you will get a free copy of the UCC connection which is an amazing book that will it will educate you to the point where you won't be afraid of the police anymore or courts corporations and governments they're all below us if and only if we overstand our republic and we overstand the grammar that they use, which is all fraudulent. So anyway, I got to get to work. Appreciate you watching. I'll, I'll, I'll make some more videos that are informational, but I just wanted to, I'm going to start making these because I don't want to sell cars anymore. I want to do this and help people. And, uh, you know, if I can make enough money so that I don't have to go to the J-O-B, then that's what I'm going to do. Appreciate you watching.
Take care. Love you all.